card three is starting. And then this is a five and three quarters. It's a dollar. Most of the stuff in here is a dollar. These are two keychains. I do not know what that is. There's a dollar. And this one holds pictures, obviously. They're a dollar each. This is a barrette that has little... They're acrylic. Um, wait. I don't know about this one. It might be glass. This looks like Mother Pearl, but it, eh, it could be a shell. It's wired on there. It's a dollar. This thing right here is a gorgeous uh, pendant, multicolored, very heavy, gunmetal. It's four dollars. Okay. This is just a pin, but it's fabric. Somebody sewed it. So cute. It's a dollar. These are pins, like pins, like these kind. Of, I have backs. I found a whole bunch of backs. I think four unclaimed backs, maybe. See all the gunk that came out there? <laughs> there was so much stuff. This right here says El Dorado uh, Civitan. Not civilian. Civit. Civitan. 40 years, maybe. Nothing on the back. Oh, wait. What did I say? Probably the company that made the pin. And I get my loop de loop. Baloo, yeah, that's one of the companies that makes pinbacks. If this means anything to anybody. And this one is says Jesus loves you with a rainbow and clouds. And it's a pin brooch. Just needs a wipe down. Dollar. This one is a pendant and has a leaf, uh, articulated leaf on it with some kind of acrylic, uh, what's made to look like a stone with a wire wrapping with a little um, jump ring for a pendant. That's a dollar. This is marbled enamel. Really gorgeous. There's the bale. Silver tone. That's a dollar. This is beautiful. Has flowers. It has a it has a jump ring for right now for a bale. If you want me to put an, a larger jump ring on a gold tone one, I will. But I won't put a bale, but a, a larger jump ring to make it stand up more. This is as a faux pearl. It's gold tone, really pretty. It's a dollar. <laughs> this is an elf, I guess. It says Y N four N. K B H China. That's a dollar. Oh, there's an earring. I mean, a ring. Ta da! This is a seven and three quarters sewer tone with three rhinestones. I th believe this is yellow, and these two are clear. What in the world is that? This is a funny pin. It looks like a guy's glasses with his mouth or his nose. Gold tone with a pin. The mechanism works. I checked it. Oh, there's a, something written on there in the corner. SC. Registered. Don't know what that is. It's a dollar. This is also a ring. I think it's a toe ring. It's malleable. You can make it to any size you want, but without stretching it, I will measure. It's it probably, a, I think it is a toe ring. It's like a nine and three, or no, eight and three quarters. It's a dollar. This is a glass ring, but it has a decal underneath to make the design. It magnifies it. It's like a some kind of animal print, but it's yellow. So it's a seven and a quarter dollar. And these are pin pins with these kind of pins on the back. I do not know what this is. Somebody's got to know. Oh, it's Sandy Hat. I had it upside down. Moron. Nothing on the back that's significant. This one says, Life's worth living in Fort Smith, Arkansas from 1842. Since 18, no, yeah, 1842. And this is a... Registration number, I believe. Yeah. 
And then this one's a little bear. It says, thinking of you. That's so cute. And it has a acrylic or rubber pin back dollar. This is RSVP. I do not know what that means. Maybe for some kind of meeting. Oh, and this has writing on here. I don't know if it's anything. Oh, well, it's, it's got to be the maker, probably. Let me look at it. It won't sit still in my hand. C. Sanders. It can't be his phone number. Oh, 818. That's uh, like um, right above L.A. Ventura, I think. And that's a dollar. And the last one, and most important, is I Love Jesus. So cute. There's nothing written on that. And that is a dollar. Y'all need some tokens. <laughs> they're from... They're from Fast Lane. I don't know if that's a bowling alley or a game arcade, whatever. This is the biggest pendant I've ever seen besides like a Western belt buckle pendant. It's gold tone with brown. Looks like wood that's been varnished. It's so beautiful. Look at the back. Look at the bale. It's huge. This is $5. Oh, and no, not last. Okay, this is Santa Claus. He's a uh, acrylic or polymer. I'm not sure. Has a little. It's like an ornament. He's a dollar. You're not gonna believe this. I'm just not gonna even say anything what it is because it's, I'm like, it, it's green. <laughs> and it's a pin. So either maybe somebody worked at a pickle factory. Okay, that's it. This stuff doesn't come with it. This is all the yonke that was in there that I got to clean up and dump my paper towel set. So that's it, my loves. Let me know what you think about all this new stuff. And uh, I, would love, I always love your feedback. I love your comments. Thank you for sharing and liking everything. Um, I, just, I, I just so love interacting with y'all. I really, really do. Um, it brings me joy. And I hope this channel brings you joy. These are crimp beads, by the way, that I'm scooping up. Crimp beads are how you stop a necklace that has um, beads on it from moving and or finish the end of a necklace or a bracelet. So now you know what a crimp bead is. They're little teeny tiny. Look, I don't know if you can see them. Teeny, teeny, teeny tiny little beads and you mash them with your with this kind of plier so they don't break them or, or make a mess on them. Yeah, they're really cool. So I have a my whole loop uh, box is full of them that I found in the bottom of the box. It's very useful because I don't have to buy them. There's another one. So that'll help me make more jewelry. Um, a couple of my pirates, our crew, have asked me to do a video on some of my jewelry that I've made, and I will do that for you. Um, I have several things in, on deck coming up, so I won't do it this week or the next, but maybe the next. I have trays of that, too, that I've made over the years, and um, if you all want to see it, I'll be proud to show it to you and maybe even sell some stuff. Um, quite partial to my stuff that I made, because every single one of them is different now. Some people used to buy it right off my neck in the grocery store or the movies or wherever I went, mall or work. Um, and that was neat. I'd go to work with, I'd go to work or, work or wherever with jewelry on and come up with none on because they'd go, hey, where'd you get that? Well, I made it. Oh, can I buy it? Well, yeah. You got money? <laughs> so, yeah. So, there you have it. Thank you very much for watching. Um, I'm glad everybody had a great day this Sunday. And um, I'm looking forward to this new week ahead. Uh, my feet have been, like you, you know, my feet have been giving me, a, and my legs have been giving me fits. So I've been able to go through the emails and mark the emails with orders. 
I haven't picked all of them yet. Normally, I said my turnaround time is within 24 to 48 hours, and I got behind a little bit this last couple of days because what I have to do when I pick the orders is stand up and pick the boxes up, move them to the chair, you know, and do that. So it's been rough. So I'll be all good tomorrow, and um, I'll catch up within a couple of days. Everybody will get their invoices. If you want them, you can hold and fill up your bag. I encourage you all to fill up your bags. I really do because I don't want your orders to be less than what the shipping is, really. That that will make me very sad. So, okay, that's it. I love y'all. Please don't forget to give me the thumbs up, please, if you enjoyed this content. And share. The more you share, the more people will subscribe. The more people will subscribe, the more more better goodies I can bring my pirates. And please subscribe. 80% of people all over the spectrum of the whole YouTube do not subscribe and they don't interact. It's just one of those 80-20 things. If you know anything about um, that type of thing, it's always 80-20. 20% 20. 20 of the people do 80% of the work and vice versa on other stuff. So yeah, it's very interesting. Analytics, I love analytics. I used it all my life in sales. So. Anyway, have a great, blessed Monday. And I'll see you tomorrow because I'll be back tomorrow with more videos. And a new box, they said, is supposed to arrive tomorrow. If, they, if it doesn't, I got tons over here. So, okay. Love y'all. Thank you very much. Ciao for now, and I'll see you in the next one. Good night.